comes after. Don't be anywhere near the crash site when it comes down. Don't get bogged down in the mud. We have to lift ourselves and each other's out and show them the light. And I don't mean light in a PC sense. There is something huge at play here. And it's bigger than the Republicans and the Democrats. It's bigger than money. It's bigger than jobs. It's bigger than you. It's bigger than me. And I know it's true because look at how Hollywood is self-destructing on Noah. And meanwhile, there's two God films out that are not coming through the Hollywood system. One is God's Not Dead, which is huge. I haven't seen it yet, but I hear great things about it. And it's, it's, it's gigantic. And the other one is Heaven's For Real. Heaven Is For Real is a movie from Sony. I watched this last night. It's great. And it's about a kid. It's from a bestseller. That kid doesn't die on the table. He's just, he has uh, his appendix bursts and he almost dies. But he sees heaven. And his dad believes him, wants to believe him, but isn't sure because he's a preacher. And what he's saying isn't quite right, isn't quite lining up. And the kid has no business knowing this. You're four. What are you talking about? And I'm watching this movie and it's speaking to me in a whole different way because that movie is saying exactly what I heard my dad say as he died, his last words. Things my father would never say. My father's last words were, okay, I understand. I'm ready. Take me with you. My dad wasn't that guy. And as I'm watching this last night, I say to my kids, this is the same story. Now, why is, why is God telling that kid, why did that happen with my dad? I think it's for you. I'm supposed to tell you there is a God. There is a heaven. There is a plan. He's got it under control. Have you always had everything you've ever needed? Even in your worst times, have you had everything you needed? Yes. You will again, no matter what comes our way. The truth, the truth is, there's a plan, you have a purpose, and you got to get to it. I don't know what it is, but he's going to help you carry out that purpose. Just do what he says. At the end of the day, if we just remember that the best farmer in the world is still at the mercy of God for weather and rain. Not too much sun, but some sun. Not too much rain, but some rain. The best fisherman in the world doesn't control the seas. We're nothing. When we stop doing the things he's telling us to do, we're nothing without him. But with him and with each other, we're unstoppable.